Hello guys, me Carl Santos and Cap Carl FF, and I'm gonna do like a breaking news as far as the new Atlanta Motor Speedway. So I'm on jsk.com right now, and they've already repaved it after like 163 days to be exact, and the reconfiguration is as the front stretch is much wider, and they took some of the grass that used to be there back in the 1990s to be exact. Which was the D-shaped oval part of the track, and and then the back stretch. Hmm, I don't think it hasn't changed, but I'm not sure based on my research. So let's go ahead and read this article from uh, jsk.com. So after 163 days of work, the crews celebrated their completion of the paving of the all-new Atlanta Motor Speedway with fireworks and cheers. So. And then the transformation of Atlanta started shortly after the checker flag on July 11th, and that, which is great because they wanted to do it as quick as possible. So, so over the course of five months, they molded the new shape of the speedway to 28 degrees banked in the corners, new drainage technology, and the coating of the brand new asphalt. So... That's great, but the thing about the asphalt is they're using the new technology of how they coat asphalt on the on the racetracks. So um, that way, there's no seepers or is that how you pronounce it? Yeah, water seepers on the track, so there's no uh, holes on the track. To be honest, so. Let's move on. So with the paving complete, the 1.54 mile oval will be hosting some of the fastest car in the world, along with the most talented racers. So, and finally, finally, this is the important part. Testing for this new next gen car from the Atlanta Motor Speedway will determine if they're gonna go with a super speedway package like Daytona and Talladega, which I'm not so sure because this might be similar to 2012 at Kansas Speedway where NASCAR, they tried to use a soft tire compound and it was a disaster. There were lots of, ca ugh, lots of cautions and I have two videos to show you to prove that if you're going to put a soft tire compound on Atlanta there's gonna be a lot of cautions like lots of spinning lots of you know what bonehead moves I'm telling you another bull crap move you know I mean what can you more ask for for Atlanta Motor Speedway so we'll just have to see and find out because Atlanta, I think they did their research according to their YouTube channel, informing fans that we're different from Kansas Speedway. We're different from every one and a half mile racetrack and just so what do you guys think of the new Atlanta Motor Speedway reconfiguration slash repave? So if you want to watch more videos of my contact Click on that bell button to get more notifications from my YouTube channel called Hepgarla9. Click on that thumbs up button if you like the video so much. Share a comment right below the description so I can share some thoughts and feelings with others in the community and make them feel welcome. So, I'm Hepgarla95. Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, and Happy New Year. Peace out. Get waiting for a caution because he knew that something had to happen there. Oh, Biffle into the wall hard in the 16. <laughs> Around Kyle Bush. Oh, draw on trouble. Into the walls, the 18, and more trouble. Sam Hornish corrected. Newman's torn up. And the yellow flag's out again. 